Hey guys, welcome back. So let's begin with the Laravel installation. Click on the first link and scroll down a little bit to find the Composer installation. Let's open the terminal and change the directory to www and change the project name to chat application. If you do not have Composer, please install it first because it makes things really easy. It takes some time uh, depending on the internet speed. So the installation has been completed. I am going to open my project with PHP Storm. Uh, if you do not have PHP Storm, you may use your favorite editor, whatever you like, no problem at all. So let's go to the .env file and change the db password and change the database name as well. And let's go to the PHP my admin to make the database localhost slash PHP my admin. Let's create a new database chat underscore application. And let's back go back to the project. We have some of the default migration files and I'm going to use that uh, actually to make the user stable. If you go to the database and then migration folders, then we have uh, migration file for the user stable. So let's migrate it. PHP artisan migrate and I'm going to use the default authentication for the Laravel so let's install the Laravel UI packages first composer required Laravel slash UI And then let's run the command php artisan ui view success auth. This will generate the default authentication files. Let's run npm install first to install the node modules packages. So the installation complete. So re-enter that command to generate auth files. Oh, but that has been already done. So I will cancel it because we have already done it. And let's run our project PHP artisan serve. Let's open the project. And let's register some users. Oh, we are missing <coughs> style and script files here because we have it to build our project we need to build our project first to generate the default JS and CSS files so let's run npm run dev this will build our project let's run npm install login first because our node modules is still not existing there and now npm run dev this will pull our project 
and this will generate the default JS and CSS files. Yeah. And let's reload the page. Yeah, looks good. So let's register some users. We'll use them throughout the project. Let's register another one. And the last one. And let's go back to the project. Let's go to the home.blade.php file. This is our home page. So I just want to update it. And the home page extends the app layout. Let's go to the app layout, app.blade.php. And then let's change a little bit things here Laravel already includes bootstrap 4 and jQuery so let's add our file here so I want to add style.css and let's create the CSS file within the CSS folder style.css also I want to add font isom here so we need font isom so let's search the CDN files for font isom font isom font isom CDN and go to that link and copy the link and then add here And let's add JS file as well. I'll create main.js file within the JS folder. So within the JS folder, let's create a file main.js. And later we'll use both style.css and main.js file. Let's change a little bit things here. Change the title. Change the title to that application. And things looks good. And let's add scripts here. So stack escapes. So our scripts will be loaded at the bottom of the body. Let's go to the home.blade.php and remove all the code here. And let's add a row, deep row, and let's add two column here. 
div dot cool md3 and div dot cool md9 in the first column let's display all the users so div dot users users ul let's give some class here class equals to list group and then list set item let's give class to the ally as well set user list and we'll, we will display the user here so let's go to the browser so things has been changed here let's give some style here Let's give some margin to the row. Margin 50px. Looks good. And let's give style to ally as well. List style none. Looks good. So let's go to the style.css file here and let's give class chat row first and let's go to the style.css dot chat row margin 50 and chat user list dot chat user list list style none 